Hi everyone, it's Cindy, and I wanted to bring you up to date on where I am with my um, Pride and Prejudice junk journal. I, I think I showed you this page from the uh, paper pad from um, DCWV, the Dear Jane stack. And I had cut it down and pieced it together to make the, the um, frame for the cover. And where did it? Um, oh, I guess that stuck down there. You better get some glue and do that. I don't know how that happened. <clears throat> I'm glad I found it though. Wouldn't that have been something? Um, anyway, so I, I did that and then I, this was, I had an extra page, actually a, an extra couple of pages. Um, there were, there were actually, um, eight pages in the digital kit. And so I put two in each signature, or three signatures, and then I had two more left. So um, I took half of, you know, actually there were two pages on each sheet, so I had two sheets left. So I cut the roses out of half of it, and this was already part of the of this piece of paper, um, uh, pattern paper. So I just mixed them together. So there's this from the digital and this from... DCWV, and um, so yeah, there's the front. The spine is one of the the books from that book page, um, and um, and then I sew the signatures in with a gold waxed linen thread, or waxed, yeah. And then there's the back, and I don't know if I want to do anything here or not. I'll wait and see what kind of stuff I have left at the end. So there's that, and then I just wanted to show you the inside and um, how it sort of came together. These were the other two pages. I put one on the inside of the front cover and one on the inside of the back cover. And I like how they look. Um, in my excitement to do all of this because it was really coming together so nicely for me, I did a kind of a boner and I, I wanted, I had planned to reinforce this uh, the the front and back covers where they attach to the spine was some muslin and I forgot to do that in my excitement to get going. So I think I'm gonna place some lace down here and have it on you know, it'll be visible but it will be it will strengthen the the connection between those two. And I don't know if I'll put any on the outside. I have to put, lay it there and see what I think of it. But uh, it, we'll, we'll see that next time. So I wanted to show you some of the things that I did do on the inside. I haven't really started to decorate yet with pockets and tags. I'm, I've been making them, but um, I haven't really placed any. Um, but I wanted to show you. I did stencil some pages, and I did some stamping. So on all of these pages, the, the cardstock from DCWB, the back of the pages was white. So I stenciled on all of those. And I also did some stamping on some various pages and I stenciled this is some of my uh, tea dyed paper that I used uh, vinyl lace uh, placement to do the dyeing with and I like how that turned out on the back of the digitals I also did stenciling um, so yeah so you can do anything on there. I did do that's one big stamp um, from Simon Says Stamp, and I just used some gray or London Fog, Memento London Fog ink, and stamped it with that really faintly just to give the illusion of pattern, but not really have it in your face so you could easily write over it. And um, yeah. So the next um, digital page and there's stuff down there. And I did, like I said, I did some stamping on various pages throughout. Um, this one actually was not one of them that I stamped on. It's on the music paper. And um, there's this is the other piece of um, paper from the from BCWB, and I, as I said, I stenciled on all of that. So there's the center of that signature, and we don't need to go through all of that. And this signature, I'll just show you real quickly um, some of the stenciling and stamping. 
I really like how that piece turned out. Um, and look how pretty that is. So I did do some stamping on this tissue paper. Oh, this is going, sorry. Um, and I like how you can see it from the other side. Um, there's this penciling I did there. And more stenciling there. Stamping there. And there's the stenciling I did on the back of that. And that's the center of that signature. And then there we have stamping and stenciling. More stenciling. Um, this is also the one that I stamped on. A little bit of stamping here on this ledger paper. And the stenciling on the back of that page. Some stamping here on this tissue paper. And the stamping and sten or stenciling there. And stamping here. And it's the center of that page or that signature. So you can see I have a lot of tags and pockets to make. I do have quite a few made, um, but I, I've got a lot to do. So I may do some of that with you in the next video. It depends on um, how far I get in the meantime, because this is all I'm going to be working on. So I don't want to get caught up in, or um, I don't know if I'll turn the camera on or not. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. So please like, comment, subscribe, come back. Thanks for watching. We'll see you real soon.